Yo, listen, we are so back. Welcome back to One Two TV. This is Eric here, Naim, Zoom, and Saddam is on the way. The semi-finals have been confirmed on Sunday. Spain to take on England in the final. But not only this show, but also the country. We are so back. We're so ready. <laughs> <laughs> How are you guys yeah. feeling, though? Good, good man. man. There's uh, there's been lots of good news today. Yeah, man. You know, from transfer signings. Nobody's talking about to those. some people losing their jobs, you know. <laughs> so we're winning. Yeah, we're winning. Mm. It's good times. Yeah, I mean, great. Zoom. How are you yeah, doing, bro? Saka and Rice in a final. So yes, that's good. Oh yeah, it feels I have, like I have nothing else. It feels like they're going to lose back to back finals, you know. You know who's lost back to back semi finals? Tell me, semi finals. Yeah. Who? Van Dijk. For real? Yeah, FA Cup now. Nah. Who counts the Africa? We're not. We're not. We're never in the in the semi-finals. Oh, you got knocked out in the quarters or something Jeez. by this man. Then they beat Coventry. They robbed oh, Coventry okay, or something. Sir, sir. Never mind. I tried. Coventry deserved to be in the final. You would have given us a good game against Man City. Stop, okay, this is stop not 2023-2024 yeah. season. You're the one who brought the FA back. Anyway, stop deflecting, man. I'm not deflecting. So Spain beats uh, France. France quite convincingly, I think. France were dead. Well, France is France's defeat was coming, you know. Uh, like. You all know they have not been as exciting as you expected this tournament. It's because they are missing one key f- player in midfield. Mbappe. Mbappe is a midfielder. Oh, so. <laughs> nice <laughs> missing Mbappe. Well. Nice one, Zoom. Who is that? Who are they missing? Paul Pogba. Yeah, but man. it's banned. Yeah, they are missing his creativity. That guy was doping. If anything, you guys and should be robbed of the exactly uh, uh, stripped of the World Cup. You should give back the World Cup and his ability. And the Europa League. And his ability to find Mbappe, you know. And the Europa League. And yeah. the Europa oh. League. Yeah, they should be. They should be that so means they wouldn't have won a trophy uh, up until the LVG one. So which means now, if Man City are, are, are stripped of the titles, this man won't get the They didn't have Paul Pogba playing for them, man. I didn't know you guys were this butt hurt, bro. Yeah. You've never had Paul Pogba play for you guys. Bro, Crazy. I had Keita in my team. You want to prem? Keita. <laughs> Keita, you know. Nabi. Keita want to prem. Nabi Keita. He's, and he's named after <laughs> the the other Nabi. <laughs> that we all know who I'm talking about, but I do not going to say his name. Ah! <laughs> Nabi <Right>. Abishuka. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Nabi Keita might have had his issues, but at least he was honest. Yeah. And he didn't do any witchcraft. But uh, the end of so our life, when you sit back and watch back the prem, yeah, you're not going to see any highlights from Nabi Keita. And list, and list the you're prem winners. You're going to see highlights listen, from Paul Pogba and his magical game. And list the prem winners and guys who contribute to winning the prem. Nabi Keita will be up there with KDB, yeah, but Paul Pogba really will be in the FA Cup list. Okay, up there with KDB is a bit of a reach. Okay, in terms of those who have won, <laughs> <laughs> he'll be back benching. Mm. At, least, up at least he'll be there. Yeah, at least he will be there, mm. yeah. So um, this guy is by the 16-year-old Lamine Yamal. Before that, if ah. you do realize, mm. United fans, when they're talking about Pogba, they talk about the World Cup, the achievements for France. Yeah, oh, everything he's done for France. They never talk about money. No, achievements. We talk, I talk, what, no what they do, do, do on his day. What do you mean, bro? <laughs> <laughs> they do on his day. Well, remember that, uh, remember like, that phrase. Like uh, the day we made the Emirates our dance floor. Exactly. You just said on his day. That's on day. His that, day. Day. that was one of that his day. days. <laughs> one of his days. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Made Koscielny look like an uh, under-14 player, bro. I don't even know if Koscielny played that game. Koscielny did play that game, bro. That was in 2019. Um, he did. Very nice. Anyway, so <coughs> let's talk about the Euros. By the way, um, <coughs> last, chance, last chance to catch the Euros uh, action is for the final. And you can still do that on GoTV with their uh, 999 offer uh, per month, which is fantastic, honestly. that's still Thank you so much for GoTV for coming through because that's how I've been watching all the action and getting all the reaction and all that. Uh, match the analysis fantastic brilliant thank you so much don't forget to like share subscribe uh, leave a comment in the section below and by the way make sure you guys follow us on our socials uh, we're very active right now uh, I don't know if you guys have noticed <laughs> yeah, there's a lot <laughs> very active mm, there's a lot of uh, stuff it's actually good these things have come during the off season yeah we have so much time and space it's true it's mm, true wow. uh, like Pogba whenever he does anything good um, we actually have anyway. a lot of a lot of content. <laughs> yeah, man. yeah, we have a lot of yeah, content. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. check us out on TikTok, Twitter, and on IG. So yeah, let's get into the games. And holy shit! Um, so Lame. Spain were supposed to have taken the lead, but they miss mm. through Fabian Ruiz, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Immediately get punished for almost the same movement, almost the same type of play by Colomani, who, by the way hasn't done anything uh, noteworthy ever since the miss 
during the World Cup final. Mm. Um, <laughs> for PSG. Yeah. Yeah. Who did uh, they play in the semis of the World Cup? Because I think that performance is one that has bought them time. Him and the other Thuram guy. Ge- didn't they play Germany? They no. Play, no, in the World Cup semi final. Oh, in the World Cup semi final. Because that performance is one that made them come early, come come on early in the in the final. Mm. Who did they play France in the semi final? Can't remember. Wasn't it one of Spain or? They played Europe? England. They played England. I think Hurricane missed a penalty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They beat oh, England. Yeah, they beat yeah. England. Yeah, they beat England. Hurricane missed a mm. penalty, right? Um, so they they immediately get punished. And they got a PSG move. Uh-huh. Yes. Spain get punished, mm. but then Lamine Yamal. What a talent! Sixteen years old, bro. You know, I saw I saw a tweet. Just for context, this guy would have been twelve when twen- when COVID broke out. Twelve years old. Okay. When COVID broke out, like that was the other day. Eric, this guy mm. when I started radio 2018, you know what I mean. He would have been still in his he single digits. He was ages, ten or bro. something. Yeah, or nine. Nine. Like it's My ridiculous, God. bro. I'm trying to imagine how much money does he earn right now, and who takes that money? Like, obviously his parents, his, parents. his guardians. I'm saying, he's, I don't know, he's not yet know. 18. Of course, of course, he's a like minor, so it's the parents who keep the money for him. Oh, okay, but you know, apparently he's already bought his uh, grandmother a house. What? Yeah, like fully taking care of her house. Yeah, yeah I'm grandma. sorry, grandma. Me, I'll never leave the block. Yeah, we never made it to Barcelona. No, but at least you're helping Kenya revive it. Yeah, of so, course, for so the generations to come. <laughs> um, so, this guy, he, we talked about it a little bit. We compared him, we compared him to Saka, but because Saka is always the standard. Um, but holy shit, he's gonna be so much better than any other winger in the world right now. Whether you're whether 25, even better than Salah, 27, I think so. Yeah, I don't think so. I think Salah is still clear of now. To be honest, no, he's clear of him now, but he's better. Th- he's gonna be better than most. Oh, Salah. in future, of gonna, course, of course, yeah, of course. Uh, I mean, assuming he doesn't have like a Pogba kind of na- or Neymar kind of career. Oh yeah, injury free. Pray for yes. him. Um, but holy shit! Um, it's another you guys from saw Barcelona. the background, the background uh, story the, to the to the game. Rabio with his interview. Yeah, ah, yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah. Why are you briefing the 16 year old? Exactly. He's becoming like Saddam. It's just Rabio. <laughs> it's just Rabio things. We, we all know Rabio is a nasty fellow. Him and his mother. I think he's even racist. I think that was a bit racist. Yeah. Just attacking the kid of color. Even that tackle on uh, Kolomuani by Nacho. That was a bit. That was a Did you guys see that 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 tackle? That was racism. The one um, where he mashed his, his head into oh, the ground. Oh, I saw the memes. Yeah. <laughs> so mm. <laughs> yeah, that was that was racism for sure. Um, you know, you're not watching the game. No, I did, no, but I think tweeted. I think that part. Yeah, was yeah, yeah. Or something. That's how Eric watches football when it's not Liverpool. When I'm watching Liverpool, you, Eric and Saddam watch. When I'm watching Liverpool, bro, I put my phone like on the other side and then I watch the game until after. I'm on my phone because I'm on Go TV, bro. I'm using the app. Come on, man. <laughs> nine nine nine. Go TV also have an app. <laughs> so, bro. bro, when you watch, which it, allows you to watch when you're not at home. When you watch you need to focus. You need time to get mad and to get happy because this minute you're happy, next minute you're mad. And Sing then the next minute you're just fighting people in the crowd. And then Luis Diaz's <laughs> father is on the stands. <laughs> it is it now in Nunes, bro? Mm. He got whacked. He bro. got <laughs> no caught on, caught on the head, mm. man. But yo, this guy, anyway, we'll get into Copa America stuff in a bit. Mm. Just one second. That was hilarious, man. Do you know? <laughs> huh? <laughs> uh, G, block G. G11. Uh. What? what exactly, bro? What do you mean, bro? Aye. In the chin. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, Lamine Yamal is a product uh, of Barcelona. <laughs> Lamine Yamal is a product of Barcelona, La Masia. And Just Morocco. And so, his parents are? Moroccan. Moroccan, yeah. No, two of them are. Uh, one of them is Moroccan, and the other one is, I think, Ibvad. Ah. But they live in Spain. It just had to be African, bruv. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, the so father. Sister, you know that little. The father looks like a little bit of yeah. sauce. Mm. You know that Zoom is lacking. Wow. And he was greeted by Messi. You remember? You saw that photo. Yeah, but do you know what his dad said, which what? was even more fantastic? What he said that maybe because guys were saying, um, "Do you think your son was blessed by Messi because Messi touched him?" And he said maybe mm. Messi Yamin. was blessed by Yamin. What? Lamar. 
Yeah. That's what his dad said, man. For real. We need to, to give that guy more airtime, in my opinion, man. <laughs> yeah, the more than Luis Diaz is father, father, bro. Quotes, <laughs> please. <laughs> because honestly, what do we get from I Luis agree, Diaz? I agree, I agree. <laughs> I mean, look, a Liverpool <laughs> fan is agreeing, bro. What are we supposed to do? Laminia must follow. To be fair, though, he doesn't look... He's so humble. <laughs> no, he doesn't look like he's all there. <laughs> yeah, bro, to say, the, to say the least, man. He doesn't look like I he's all there, man. Even being you know? quite polite. Yeah, yeah. yeah like it's because we're, it's we're of, on air, you know yeah. what I mean? I, I think, think this is the first media training and everything. Kidogo. Yeah. Kidogo. Kidogo. This is the first Project Mbappé. <laughs> yeah. Actually, that's probably the first. Yeah, yeah made, but he's already surpassed Mbappé. They made it at 16. They nah, made it bro, at 16. Guys, this nah, is nah, nah. Mbappé was actually really good at 19 or something. Bro, Mbappé was doing it at 18 in the French League. This guy is doing it in La Liga and the Euros at 16. Mm. But then this guy, this is his first game to play for Spain. What do you Major mean? tournaments. First, yeah, first first ever time. No bench, straight to the straight, straight to, the, to the to the, to the, to the That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, I just think he'll be, anyway. My all, days, even Barcelona is playing for Barca so well. And then Dani yeah. Olmo, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dani Olmo scored a wonderful goal. Worldy, yeah. bro. That, uh, worldy is a bit... A a world, like that player. was a worldy, bro. Daniel was a the issue is injuries, player. though. Yeah, I think he's so unlucky. Bro. No, he is. Like mm. he's he's a player that would fit into Barca, Real Madrid. Yeah, yeah. you know these he's technically gifted Leipzig. teams. Leipzig, yeah, yeah, he plays for Leipzig. And ever since he scored that goal on the internet, I've been seeing guys like post, post different actual goals, yeah, different like actions he does in games, and you can just see he's such a high IQ player, man. Mm. Mm. Hey, you need to give credit to the coach though for the Spain coach. Yeah. I think he has no one expected first of all this performance mm-hmm. and all this man because let's say like now last season if you ask someone can done almost like power up in the euros like that you'd be like mm, it's not like one of those big names that you expect yeah you wouldn't play. even choose him in fifa or anything mm. or you know, but like kukure bro kukure, kukure mm. is showing his true colors mm. Mm. but he's going back to chelsea then get benched yeah by chilwell well chilwell is going united so we'll, we'll get into that but then they i'm sure they'll sign a left back those guys don't even care about you can't you can't rely on Luke Shaw, but we'll get into that. Um, no, talking about Chelsea, talking about oh, Chelsea, Chelsea, bro. Chelsea, Just put on so. your fucking. So, um, Danny Olmo, uh, Merino, Brian Ruiz, uh, oh, Jesus yeah. Navas at right back, for example. So that guy's um, older than Yamin Yamal's father. Yes, he is. Because <laughs> hey, but he's played for. He long is, imagine. Goal. He played the World Cup in 2010. He's the only person remaining now. He Seriously, almost all the another. country is playing. Yeah, yeah, shit, yeah, yeah. That's sick. Yeah. You won the World At Cup. that time, he was playing as a right winger. Yeah. No. Um, so. And he may go to the next World Cup. So it's yeah. He, I think he he actually could. He, he was given a lifetime contract, well. I think, by his club. Sevilla. It's Sevilla. Mm, yeah. I think it's Sevilla. Mm. Um, I just think Spain. Yes, you can you can understand or expect that they'll play, uh, very nice, slick football. You know that kind of stuff. Uh, nice touches, technical ability, but they're playing with an intensity that we and haven't a joy. seen in a long time. And yeah. a joy, it's well, a joy. Me, me, for me, it's the joy that they're playing with. Like they're trying things that they you didn't normally see in a well-drilled team because it's obviously tiki taka based, like possession based football. But then the wide players seem to have freedom. They know when to pass the ball, when to dribble. It's really exciting to watch. Yeah. And, and they've been fun with the ball. Yeah, I just hope they really give England a smacking, man. And you know they were missing some key players by the in the yeah, semis. They were. And those guys are gonna come back in the final. So um that's Morata. The Morata looks aged. Morata he's not aging, captain. man. <laughs> he's the captain. It's crazy, bro. Yeah. And that Rodrigo is unbeaten in like three, four games <laughs> or something. Morata got kicked by one of the security guys, yeah, right? That's weird. And he looked like it could have been a knee injury. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um anything nice to say about France, really? Well, Saliba. I thought no, I thought final. I thought Kante was really good, and I I I don't know yeah, why. Give his best. I I thought that was a wrong sub, from Deschamps. He should have just panicked. I should, I don't think I think he should have kept on Kante and taken off Chouameni. Did you, did you guys see Chouameni's slander name on in, uh, on Twitter, bro? No. Oh my god! <laughs> what was it? Oh my god. Because yeah, of that yeah, clip yeah. that's been going around yeah, about that. Shorty. Yeah, the shorty with the get into it then if you want to get the into the game it. plan, you know her game, game plan game. for approaching nighttime activities. Even supposed like what's a new name? Yeah. So Chumeni oh, has a new name. Who? Slobo. 
blow job also. Blow job. <laughs> <laughs> blow job, man. Ah, man. My guys, but we're back next season. You know, back, we'll back, see, to back to do what? Back to do what? To do what? Yeah? To, do what? to bottle it again. In the prime this season. Anyway, so, so, so. Can't wait for the Premier League. said you got relegated. Relax. Of course you're in the prem. Of course. And Champions League. So is there anything nice to say about France except Huak Chua? No, no. Huak Chua needed to bounce. Kante oh, okay. needed to stay on. I thought Kante played really well. Like, even... So, his tournament has been really good, man. We need to talk about Mbappé. Outside yeah. Kante for Kante United. might actually be his real age. How old is he? Whatever age. Whatever he is. age. He 38. Is. I think that's his real he's age. 38. He's like 34 now. Yeah, he probably he probably he probably got, was born immediately with a certi- uh, certificate. You know, I mean, two with what? all the protocols <laughs> done. What? He's such a goody two shoes. Has, has there been anything wrong with him? Has ever has there been any kind of slander about him? Ever in the media, I just you see a mistake. Maybe he was riding his bike too quickly. Yeah, you know. I just think um, he's like, you know, when I used to play, okay, no. we used to go for away games and we used to go to like Western, and because when you in Western, you're playing guys from Shags, right? And they're eating all this natural stuff. They're sharing like with hard water, mm-hmm. and I don't know what I'm saying, but <laughs> I just feel like Kante nimse a Western. A yeah, choki, I, I just, nimgumu, I you know what I mean? Whatever this is, is racism. No, it's not. No, I think you guys know what, I'm, what I mean, bro. I understand, bro. <laughs> so what is it? So you know like Homeboys FC for rugby? Like from Western, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. They're from Western, A right? lot of Western players. Yeah. yeah. And you've seen how hard they are compared to people like yeah. from Nairobi. Yeah, of course. That's what I'm trying to say. Mm. Yeah. 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 So, you see now that... Fre- I'm a friend of Western. <laughs> that performance from... That performance by France... Idinade. <laughs> Put us in a yeah, <laughs> yeah. Man. Anyway, now, uh, and Pape um, now didn't have a good tournament. Of course, he admitted. And, and I saw you know, he's supposed to go to Real Madrid and now light up their world. Mm. They just won. And do, they need, do they need? Of course they don't. Mbappe. They just won the La Liga and the Champions League. What kind of cost? Of course they don't. The no, because they're just no, greedy. We all know they're trying to replace uh, Karim Benzema, right? They don't They've have. A, they that. don't have a striker. They have. They have Hosilu, right? No. They so do you think he's gone to Saudi? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they had Hosilu. So yeah. do you think Mbappe fits as a number nine? Rodrigo as a number nine in that Real Madrid team. Rodrigo's gonna play from from, from Nene, number nine. No, no, no. I, I think, think it's Mbappe. Rodrigo, Rodrigo so Vinny? getting benched. I bro. think it's Mbappe, bro. I think it's Rodrigo on side, Mbappe middle, Valverde. What yeah. about the Rodrigo mean. played right wing before? What yeah. about the AI generation Pele? Hendrik. Hey, Hendrik. They Hendrik. Is that photo of him? But Why are you saying as if they even have Endrick? Who's Endrick? They even have Adagula. He's done nothing actually. Yeah, like could you people? I saw, I saw, I saw something. Could come in? But the one so funny on him too. I don't want to be with nineteen year olds. <laughs> Bro, that guy. People, Barca, <coughs> I saw Barca fans that he post um, uh, Yamal PR versus uh, Endrick PR. Mm. That's all it's ever gonna be. It's P- it's not gonna be anything else. So Barcelona fans, we do think. That guy's gonna be the answer, Fati. Yeah, I think so as well. Mm-hmm. All right, let's see, man. Let's see how it goes. Bro, that Copa America game was nowhere to be seen. Did he start? Nah, he came from the bench. Uh, one starts for Spain, the other one is on the bench. I mean, there's no comparison. Really. Levels. Yeah, yeah, of course. Mm-hmm. Um, but now, that performance by Mbappé now brings us now to the main thing now this summer. Deschamps should be No, signed. no, even that. Okay. Deschamps has signed a new contract. He's going to go what to the World the Cup. What the fuck? <laughs> Until the World Cup. How yeah. many times are we going to watch this you, shit football? I'm telling you, this guy has, he has the Federation's chairman's nudes, bruv. I'm telling you, that's the only so now, explanation, man. That performance now brings us... Because he's the he's equivalent of Southgate. He really is. But, 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 team is one. but Eric, Eric thinks he's justified because he's won a World Cup. Yeah. Compare it to Southgate? Yeah, compare it to Southgate, actually. But he won. They play the same France game. won the World Cup despite despite the champs, bro. Huh? Yeah, yeah. Bro, well, that team did. was too good, man. Not they to didn't win. Need but it's the one who played that team teams, together. They're playing teams, they're know, playing teams team like that, Croatia. There's that, there's that team that he took to the Euros final in 2016, and they lost to Portugal. Yes. And then he took out almost all this all this man who were playing for him for that year in 2016. He tried to bring all these young players. Mbappe being the captain. Hey, Mbappe was no, the captain. Okay, no, no. Before before that, now with Akina Pogba now coming to play. Uh, Giroud, Griezmann. What was so hard about choosing those players, Eric? This players you played Giroud there. striker. You played um, Mbappe as the right right striker. You played long ball with Pogba I think and Kante like and twice. Matuidi, right? Yeah. I mean, you put three central midfielders and one in in central midfield position. Then you have Pavard. You, played you guys remember that France had that fiasco in twenty ten in South no, Africa. Yes, there was, the but Cup. there was nothing revolutionary he did. He brought the talent together. He, he no, <sighs> 
Bro, the team you have around Probably there's you another there. coach who doesn't play Giroud in that World Cup and maybe they don't win it. Nah, bro. Giroud wasn't the most important thing. He was he was a vibe. If you bring like, a Premier League coach who doesn't play Giroud that because of the numbers. Those guys are plus with the with the striking numbers. Nah, Giroud's numbers were actually decent. No, no, for no. Chelsea before he before he won the World Cup. No, but the role that he was playing, he didn't quite to Actually, score goals. Yeah, he was in Chelsea. He was in Chelsea. Yeah, he was like, but either yeah, way, yeah. I also feel that he's overstayed there for now because there's a new generation now. This young kid, so yeah, Germany. man, and he, I don't think he has a tactical mm. like flexibility to play with them. Look at the Sp- Spain coach that he's playing. Look at even like Switzerland. Switzerland yeah. before they went out, they were playing. Ball, Refreshing man. Turkey. Turkey as well, bro. So, um, so, like you know, it doesn't have to be the same stars. Grizu, like I just think gr- the French national team has left Griezmann, man. <laughs> Honestly, it's left him. What does he add? What is? I don't. I don't understand what. Fortnite, he France. Fortnite celebration. France before no, France I, I, th- I think the only reason they they have him there and guys like Teo Hernandez is to get through customs. That's Honestly, mad. bro, that's mad. You know, like I think <laughs> secretly, yeah, they, they they say you can't choose. All of them as black players. Yeah, you can't. <laughs> you, you have a limit. You have to remember there's yeah. some white in the French flag. Una white, a French flag. Let it be represented by some. <laughs> what do you mean? Hey, well, have you not seen their lineups these days? Yeah, but like, nah, England, those are England justified. Still very white. Those are justified though. England is still very That's white. That's why they have Konagalga there. <laughs> what? And pick four. Pick Bro, four. the whole back line is white. No, it's not. Except Cal Walker. And Trent. And McGuay. Trent is on the bench. McGuay. Okay, yeah, true. Mm-hmm. But then you have Harry Kane, you have Phil Foden, you have... Uh, Trippier. Foden. What's it called? Doesn't uh, Gwei remind you of that thing? Don't be Gwei. <laughs> so you guys, I was going to ask you gay. now. Don't be I was going to ask you now. Now that Mbappé has gone out like that. <laughs> I think of an elephant in the room again. Ballon d'Or this year. You're going you're gonna, to... Uh, elephant in the room? Give it to Yamin Lamal. Lamin Yamal. What? Well, Lamin Yamal, yeah. Hey, bro. Um, you think so? was, uh, Vini has flopped in Brazil, yes. Copa America, and Pape flopped. I think it's going to be Jude. If Jude wins, Jude Bellingham. If Jude wins the Euro, I think I think it's going to oh be Jude. I think it's between if uh, I think it's between Messi, Luis Diaz. Messi. Yeah. Luis Diaz. Messi. Luis Diaz. Luis Diaz. You mentioned Messi, then you mentioned McAllister. No, I know what you're doing. I know what you're doing. Mention Haaland. Go on, go on. Go on. Let me see this. Messi, uh-huh. Luis Diaz. Yeah. Yamin, uh, Lamin Yamal and Bukayo Saka. Bukayo Saka. Disgusting. Saka what scores the that? winner against against Spain. He's not even the best player at Arsenal this season, bro. Yeah, he's not even the best <laughs> player in London, <laughs> bro. It's part of this. It's part he's not of even the, the best dog. winger in London he's this the best, season, He's bro. the second best right winger in the Euros right now. Huh? huh? Yes. You're mad. Who's but better? Lamin Yamal. That's, I, swear, I said second. There's another There's one. There's only two teams left, cuz. That's, That's the only one I'm saying. Cody Gakpo is clear of soccer. Ah, shut the fuck up, bro. I mean, so. I mean, they should cancel Ballon d'Or this year. Because if they give Jude... It's Jude, bro. Who bro, else is there? I can't take it, Jude, man. I, I, mean, I, can't, I can't, can't take, take Jude it. having it, man. Like, well, it's I, Jude, if you watch man. Jude, bro, you know, you know when you play with... like, When you watch Jude play, it's like mm-hmm. using two buttons on FIFA. Nah. Ananga skills, bro. Nah, he has Jude skills. And watch Musiala. No you guys are crazy, man. Ugh. Don't base his tournament... Don't base the Ballon d'Or win... Off of what and else? off of the Euros entirely. Look it's at true. his form for Real Madrid. Look at what he's done for Real Madrid. Look at how he's been playing for Real Madrid. Oh, he's won Champions League and and La Liga in yeah. his first season as a number five. Zidane's number, boy from Birmingham. Zidane's number. Yeah, <laughs> number five. Zidane's number. You want to say that? Hmm? What's that? Huh? Oh, okay, sir. So Can yeah, I, it has to I be. Know, it man. has to be belly goal. It's, it's just gonna be the most underwhelming. Well, how? La Liga, yeah. No, and how many goals did he score this no, season from midfield? How many goals? How many goals has he scored this season from midfield? I think around twenty. Bro, what are we? What are we even discussing? We've seen here, those man? goals before. It was b- before the Euros. We've seen those goals before. We were so Lampard do it. We've yeah, seen. Turin really deserves a. Bruno came close to that. Bruno, yeah, Bruno. Bruno KDB. Yeah, but he didn't win the league and the Champions League. Madrid and he didn't, the league he, didn't, he didn't have a his national team didn't get to the final of a Euro. That's why it's, it's just so underwhelming. It's, it's, like, it's like it's like it's like giving Haaland the Ballon d'Or when 
he he should just be given the best. Nah, but the stuff he's been doing, the stuff, the stuff, the stuff. This year, I think even he has a chance. Who? Aling Hala. Nah, bro. The stuff you look at the numbers that we've been doing. You guys are, you guys are, you guys are, you guys are so forgetful. The stuff, the stuff Jude Bellingham has been doing this season. You guys want? I want to argue. It was foreign last season. Do you guys remember the goal he scored against Barca? El Clasico. It's the first ever El Clasico. Do you remember? Yes. The top. Do you remember even in the previous round for England, the overhead kick? He's 20 now. He's like 19, 20, bro. My God. Uh, man, you guys are, you guys are so, tiring, man. I can, see, I can see your point of view, but it's just a bit underwhelming. We're only giving it because only, of more choices. It's only underwhelming because Zoom. at this point in time, we you have can no choices tell. By no, no, no. We have, there's no other choices, but he's obviously the, the, only. the best choice right now. He's the only. He's the best choice. He's the only. I, I'm tired, man. I need Saddam. Where's Saddam? But you need Saddam. <laughs> yeah, yeah, We're not convinced. We're not sold. I'm not sold, bro. You know, you guys are just weak. Jude Bellingham, bro. I, first of all, I don't know why you're asking for Saddam. I don't think Saddam would agree. You know, I just need an, a different opinion. <laughs> We're just uh, disagreeing with you. Come on. All right, a, a guy from Mazi's side and a guy from London. Let's talk about bro. the England game. And the I'm not even Netherlands pushing game. Salah's agenda. Yeah? Yo, let's <laughs> talk about the Netherlands-England game. That, was, that game was boring as well, man. No, I think it was interesting. First half only. First half was interesting. First half was interesting, and then maybe like from the seventy fifth. So was that a pen, Eric? Mm. Yeah, let's start with. I Eric. think that's unfair. That's too harsh on. He's called Dumfries. Yeah, I think that's too harsh on him because I've even seen like the playbacks. Kwanza Saka replay. handled it. I think they called replays. No, even before that, I think the pen that Ken got the Ken the pen that Ken yeah. converted. I think they're called replays. I think it's unfair. Uh, what did I say? Playbacks. Playbacks. But anyway, go on. Go on, I director. Go on, director. Yeah. yeah. Sorry, <laughs> my bad. I I think that's too harsh. Yeah, that's I think in the prem, that's given or not. Sometimes it's not given. You can't give that. It's you only given give in the prem if it's against Manchester United. Don't play victim okay. card, yeah. bro. The thing is, like, I think it's very clear there's contact. Yes, that's obvious. But just because there's contact doesn't mean that's a pen. You can clearly see, Harry Kane is done kicking that ball. That's as good as he could have kicked mm-hmm. that ball under that pressure. You got? I think the ref got pressured by Harry Kane. The way he reacted, the way he went down. There were studs. That's the thing. There were studs. Because mm. he went with his foot up. Yeah? yeah, but like, how else is he supposed to go? Is he supposed to go with his foot down like this? You no. can't even go that yeah. far, bro. He, he ain't no ballerina. Get me? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> See, ballerina goes like with a pointed toe. Anyway. So, yeah, yeah. yeah so in my opinion, you haven't asked me, but it was never a pen. Never a pen. No. Did you catch? Because I didn't ask you. A little bit, yeah. Okay, so. Yeah, yeah. Um, was there a foul well, on moving. Declan Rice? We're well, moving on. Never, bro. Why, Javi Simmons? Never, no. bro. It was a clear Your foul. Your guy was sitting grass. <laughs> it was because he was fouled was into the grass. No, no, no. That was fair and square. Well, like, he, well, was, he actually uh, tripped He was him sent up. back to Colney. West Ham. London Colney, bro. Bro, he was actually He was sent back to that final that they won with West Ham. It's called what? <laughs> Conference League Conference final. League. <laughs> Can't believe you dapped that up, man. I dapped that <laughs> up, bro. I dapped it up. You were sent back to those bad balls at West Ham. Yeah. Sure, that was a foul. No, I think that was not a foul. I mean, come on, Zoom. There's not even anything there. <laughs> Yo, why can't Pickford save long shots, man? His sounds are short like Kepas. What's going on there, bro? Yeah, but that was a banger, man. Did you see the speed it was traveling at? Uh, and, and then he it moves faster Chavis than Simmons it, was mov- that thing. it was moving faster than Eric's car can, could ever Which manage. Car? I have a new car now. <laughs> You have a new car? Yeah. Which one? You'll see it next week. Futsubishi, man. You're mad. Futsubishi. <laughs> <laughs> 3.0. I have many cars. There's a car that I come up, I come to you with, and then there are cars that I go to other places with. Oh. Yeah. Uh, when so I come in to see you guys, I come with the old car. We're not important. Nah, you know. Damn. Mm. You said in my podcast that I, that guy is faster than my car. <laughs> you expect me. <laughs> anyway. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Javi Simmons did even even did that thing where like you fall after you kick it. You yeah, just know everything's yeah. behind that ball. Eric wouldn't know though. Eric, what? Eric doesn't have even that technique, bro. Mm. Owner your tech. Owner your tech. Go go. Well, I don't have. Eric got those catch feelings, bro. Those catch feelings. Eric hana form. Akichapa ball hana form. You ain't got the facility. I think he even does his hands like this, bro. No, you're you know mad. Then I'm Sterling. Yeah, a little bit. So I, can, um, so I can play for Chelsea. Razzmatazz. <laughs> so I can play for Chelsea. All right, let's let's talk about predictions and then we get into some transfers. <laughs> we talk about <laughs> goals that they scored. England scored. Because Saka oh yeah, shit. The there was Oli Watkins. Saka scored the ball. Oh, I just said that. The Oli Watkins goal. No, 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 no. The um, the 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 hurricane pen should have been called back oh, before the penalty because oh, yeah. Saka actually handled the ball. Oh yeah. yeah. And I think he should have been sent off. 
Oh yeah, speaking about soccer, man. Bro, I'm so sorry for any disrespect, man. Have you guys seen this shorty, bro? Crazy, Ooh, bro. She's hot. All the luck, she like makes up for all of his lack of aura. You know, and I, I get it. That guy has plenty of aura. Nah, he has what no aura mean? at all, bro. What? Well, like, he look, he keep, he reminds me of a of a of a primary school kid. Just he, his yeah, face. He's so. He, he, he's, I think he's just so one of those innocent. people who he's look young man. always, bro. No, he just always looks young. He has a baby face. You guys see that picture of him kissing his girlfriend with the eyes open, bro? But I saw, get him. I yeah, understand. Yeah, exactly. You have exactly. to see that thing. You have to. What people wanna kiss him? No, but you see how beautiful his girlfriend is, bro. The guy is saying, "I get it," because mm. if I was kissing her, I wouldn't take my eyes off. Masterpiece. Oh, wow. You know, you take. You don't take your eyes off the ball. Saka knows all about Unless that, you're Darwin Nunes. Anyway. <laughs> 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 He's got more goals than a striker. Who is a striker by then? <laughs> Kai Havertz. Eh? What eh? about the other guy they go from Man City? Who's that? It's called Gabriel uh, Jesus. <laughs> right, but then we, Manchester United just signed. But it's got uh, a very good goal against Man United. That's, yeah, yeah. that's, that's Gabi Jesus, man. Who is that? Jixi. We just signed the... Uh, do you watch? Jixi. Jixi. <laughs> so what happens now <laughs> to Hoyland? Is he love Yes, he's Dutch. Yeah. What, happened to, Dutch what happens now to Hoyland? Yeah, what happened to Hoyland? And Successful guy. teams, I think you'd know, have more than one striker. Eh? Successful teams true, have yeah. more than so one striker. So between you guys and Brentford, so which one do you think is better? we have a better attacking. attacking. Once we sign Ivan Tony, you don't get definitely us. Now. What do you mean? You're getting the third best striker in that club. <laughs> in Wisa and Buemo are, are better best. than Ivan Tony. No, but we need, I think we need, <laughs> we need an established. <laughs> Why don't you get Wisa? Wisa is actually a bowler. Apart from being racist, why don't you get Wisa? What do you mean apart from being yeah, racist? Apart, you're going to play that, of course. No, like, he's like going to say that because he looks like he comes like from West Ham. Just, <laughs> again, you know. No, come on. <laughs> I, do. I was saying I rate guys from Wisa the Western, is man. Big, <laughs> man. Including Kante, who needs to go do back. Cobra Shane, so that means you rate Wisa? I rate him. You yeah. rate Buemo? Yeah, I rate you, bro. Yeah? Your performances. <laughs> Your performances. But Wisa, but Wisa carried you for the last three months. Yeah. He carried you. When you came When you came back from your injury. When you came back from your injury. You are lacking. You have to admit, Eric. There's all those homeboys parties you've been going for, man. Yeah. I like Wisa though, from Afcon. No, Wisa is fucking brilliant, man. Mm-hmm. Anyway, um, predictions before we get into for transfers. the final. Yes, Spain, England. First you know, final in the Euros ever, by the way. By yeah, 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 for, yeah, 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 for England. For England. They were there last time. What do you mean? That was. Oh, in a foreign country. Sorry, in a foreign country. On foreign soil. Foreign soil, yeah. Oh, first oh, time, they've, was, oh, first time they've come out of semis, basically. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. And I think so because of the challenge, I think Spain win like one nil. Although I'm fair in England, they some they someone come up with late goals. I I just see them doing low block, you know, very defensively. <laughs> I think for to beat in England, you need to score your goals early enough. This is way they play. Like in the last last minutes, they know how to come back with goals. Yeah, like that Watkins goal was mm. mad though. Even the semis, the the quarters, the Jude, yeah, the mm. Jude one as well. Ah, so they're moving like every coast. <laughs> so do you guys think England should start with Harry Kane or Oli Watkins? Oli Watkins, bro. Because every time Oli Watkins has come Captain. off the bench, Captain. he's been... To- yeah. He's yeah. done more. I'm ones. telling you. I'm telling he's done you. more. I'm telling you. Harry Kane is never in the box, first of all. He's he never w- he wants runs. to come... Brother. He wants to drop deep. He compresses the space for the midfielders. He's over there it's chilling like, with John Stone. Bro, bro, if Watkins on Sunday is 100% and Kane is 50%, they start with Kane. It's true. But bro, if they play with Watkins, yeah. Saka will play at 150%. Phil Foden will play at 150%. But this is the way, this this way, way, you see the way he came to the rescue of Saka because Saka has mm. been really underwhelming. Anyway. Zoom. There's something they the all, fuck? He just, he literally what? carried they them what? into that. Huh? Zoom. Uh, the last game? I'm the talking about the last game. He was really underwhelming. He was jaded. Jaded, Jaded. from a proper title challenge. Yeah, and also yeah, his girlfriend, man. Sorry, Saka. It's gonna be a back-to-back losses for Saka in the finals. That's your prediction. Same. Yeah, of course. That's my prediction as well. I'm gonna go three nil in uh, Spain. Three. Mm. Yeah. Oh. I think I'm gonna go. They let in chances, man. They're not that good, even defensively. Who England? Yeah. I think I'm gonna go three one. Two. To Spain. I see three. So we'll one. agree Spain because Spain game. as well. Um, from the way France were playing against them, mm. basically on the counter, I feel like England also have weapons that they can use against the Spanish. They just need to make sure that they counter properly. I think that the main difference, right, is gonna be between <coughs> like who wins the fight between <coughs> Saka and Kukurea. You think that's the main difference? That's the main difference. I think if Saka wins that every day, man. No, no, no this, this is Kukurea. new and improved Kukurea ah, yeah, of the Euros. Yeah, yeah in the Prem we agree that Saka wins that yes. battle. Yes. Nah, man. Mm-hmm. 
Kukurea was even having uh, moments against Dembele. Did you guys see? That's Dembele though. This is Saka. This is Dembele with 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 the Dembele starts for your club. Yeah, that's His true. output that's was true. kicking the ball you out into the no, side I'm netting. I'm saying bro. this is Saka. Wait. So I'm saying Saka Dembele is a Dembele club. with output. Oh, yes, okay. he does on the right. Oh my who? God. Who is the right winger? Anthony. Ah, okay, 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 okay. I who starts for the club? Dembele. Of course, bro. Mm. Even with one leg, he starts. Okay. He's always injured, you know that? See, they already have Anthony started with only one leg. Doesn't use his right. My point exactly. Yeah. Mm. Um, Sawa. Um, transfers. Okay, so I guess Fabrizio Romano, here we go. You're happy. Oh, we're going Joshua transfers. We're doing, we're, doing, we're doing transfers. Yeah. Oh, wait, we're doing. you didn't give your Li- prediction. Liverpool won't have anything. You didn't give your this prediction. This guy won't have anything oh, to talk about. Three one or something. This guy won't have anything to talk about if we're doing transfers. It's just fine like, for now. Just like Arn doesn't have any hair. <laughs> you know? Huh? Just like Arn Slot doesn't have any hair. No, listen. Uh, this guy, Richard, you said that. Zero. Richard said that. Richard Keys. Richard Hughes said oh. that this. Who the fuck is that? This is our new sporting director or something. Ah, the assistant. Yes, yes. We will see him like some activities at the end of the euros at the end of after the euros so expect something from next week uh, i don't know like man united well, these ones have like generational problems to address yeah. generational <laughs> problems <laughs> As it's only like a few positions to fill the bench because tiago <laughs> left and adrian left and kayla may leave so our first team salah is old Salah is old by his brother you are and like said nunes, leave. Nunes, yeah. nunes doesn't score goals doesn't score goals Lu- 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 Luis, Luis diaz is not a uh, championship we winning need to think winger what to your center back pairing I'm is not the best. By Europa League guy. Oh, no, I'm telling you, man. bro, your Liverpool team that has so many holes that you just don't see. <laughs> have you seen your team? Of course, I accept. Last season, every week, I and you're saying that you have only a few things to address. We have to sort. Your right back is susceptible to attacking, bro. You have <laughs> things to talk about. You got a new coach who's gonna have to acclimatize to a new league, bro. Come on, man. I think yeah. the Chill only out. You guys should have even started agent. your transfer thing before the, the Euro started. That, you know, we don't do transfers like you, please. You, no, you should have started. Like you. You should I don't have think started. you're the club to tell people to do transfers. I'm you telling you, bro. I, I should be the one. actually signed some players. Who did you guys sign? No, but the point is, United fans are not the people to tell FSG, people to do transfers. FSG want to buy Bordeaux. Bro, this man that's, have been that's all signing Steve right Sanchez, Anthony. You're not lecturing me about signings. I am lecturing you. I would rather stay signing. You guys have not been signing Stewie. That Lavia, you've not been signing Caicedo, you've not been signing, you know, like... We'll see movement after the Euros, and I'm sure we're going to say that People are moving right now, even before the Euros. You're we'll talking, some you're saying they're not like United, they've already signed a striker. Even last year, last Did you summer. see the kid they signed from Chelsea? He's a oh. talent. 15, 14 years old. He's a talent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a talent. So he's starting. No, he doesn't start, of course. So no, it's it's we don't like you. Man, you see, on, we're bro. sorting even our future. You guys like to, to sort the problem when it, when it comes. Bro, we, our future is sorted. So... Huh? Calm down. Who's that? Who's your we have the great, one of the greatest academies in the world. So no, just you calm don't. down. We do. Who has come out of that Inter- academy? Bro, like two players yeah, oh last my season. God, man. Two players from last season. <laughs> How many have come from your academy? No, in the no, last no. Five five seasons? Seasons. I what the fuck is this guy? Academy? And your academy from we the last five the seasons? We don't claim Nobody we're the best. Said we're we're the, the only team in the Premier League to have an academy player on the bench for the last. Chelsea is the best. From 1935, bro. In terms of numbers from the agent. What? Some bullshit. What no, no, no. So many academy players, bro. No, no, no. We are the only team mm. in the Premier League mm. every match day mm. ha- to have an academy player. Because of the, the problems lineup. that you have. Not the problems, bro. <laughs> so since the 1935, what kind of problems? In 2007 <laughs> and winning the treble, did we have problems? It's because of the problems. <laughs> you have no oh options. Man, Guys on, are injured. Man, come, come on, man. Oh, you didn't send players. Grow up, bro. Yo, the only the only good player <laughs> you guys have had in the acad- from the academy is Mainu. Jesse Lingard, Rashford. Bro, let's not talk about players who are now. Bro. Look at if they play, no, where no, they no, play, no, no, how they play. I'm just talking about. I'm you're, just you're, talking about a pathway from academy football to professional. Bro, you're chatting about the academy when last season where so, like seven players play for my for the for the senior team. So you, you, you should be talking about and they won a trophy. And they won a, and they won a talk trophy. about asking, it. No. Talk about it then. But you're not chest stumping here. Yeah, I don't see them in the Euro. You are top five chest stumping competition. You do not see the Who's stumping the chest, bro? You did. That's what you said. We are the best. We are not. That's literally what you're doing, then. What proves that? The fact that we... I've just told you. What? We're not convinced. I just We're told not you, man. That's not convincing. Last just season. because you have a player doesn't mean you have a... No, we have had many Kambuala players Kambuala. every season. Kambuala, yeah. Kambuala is the only person who came from, the, from the academy. And he flopped. Last season. Yeah. Who else? Mino, Mino. Okay, Mino. Garnacho. Garnacho came the other season from the FA Cup yes, that won. The, the youth team that won the FA Cup. And Facundo. Oh, Facundo is even Facundo from Facundo Perestri. He's being carried by... Bro. Come on, man. Scott McTominay also is from the academy. Ah, yeah. Bro, these, these are all players, failures. Man. Johnny Evans. Come on, man. 
all these players are from the academy. Jamil is academy player. Yeah, he's so shit. No, no wonder that makes. With so the Premier sense. League, how many That's Premier League does Chiki. Saliba have? Even John Chiki. Chiki has a Premier League. Numbers League. wise, right now, let me let me give you the facts. Numbers wise and the talent wise, mm. Chelsea and Man City have got the best. Where academies. where are the, where are the academy players? Do they Check even players. do they do they play for the? Are there any academy players playing for Chelsea right now? Yes, Madueke. No, not just Chelsea <laughs> only. From <laughs> Why do you think Dominic Solanke yeah, came from? Madueke is not a. It's not a Chelsea player. Chukwemeka. Bro. It's not a Chelsea player, man. Sky, man. Get Listen, when I say Chelsea, Ma- face, no, when bro. I say Chelsea, Mason Mount. Say Listen Mason to my Mount. point. Mason Mount doesn't play for them. When exactly. I say Chelsea, I don't mean that means they have to be academy, playing for the club. I, mean? I don't mean they have to be playing for the, Chelsea. What's right now. the point of a of a of a youth team? What's the point of having an academy? You can sell if they're not able. Your if they're not able to start for you. No, 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 no. It's not just to start. Even no, selling. If they're not able to progress as to professional, it's like now a source of revenue. We've talent. We've gone to Chelsea, gotten the talent. No. Okay. Okay, tell Dominic me which Solange tell me which Chelsea. tell me which Liverpool players you've sold from your academy that have got a new uh, revenue. Ati? Yeah, tell me which tell players me. you've sold from your Liverpool Liverpool academy that have got a new revenue. Uh, let me think. Yeah. You know more like you that I have to be remembering these things. I mean, it's cuz they hardly ever happen. Yeah. We don't have to sell. We put them to play for us. Get get us a like name. Who, Stop bro. talking. Trent is winning the Champions League with us with Real Madrid maybe. Huh? Huh? Trent won the Champions League with us. Yes, but now next he's gonna. Mm-hmm. Is there any player you guys have sold from the academy? From the academy, uh, I have to think. Yeah, no, mm. exactly. That's his point. Anyway, but I'm not yet so just like anyway, him. Anyway, anyway, so like him. Fair, movement. Yeah. Where, which signings would you like to see? Give me a week season? or no, two. No, bro, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I'm done We're being now. aggressive. I'm asking you a question. Mm. For the Liverpool squad, mm. what signings would you like to now, see? Now from last season going to the summer now and even when Charu End was admitted and considering the players that left first of all need a six that's true from last season from the start of last season Wataru End is leaving no no Wataru oh, okay. Wataru End admitted that he's 30 or that something he oh, can't right. be offering what let's say 26 years old or 25 mm. or 23 year olds are offering and it's the reality so we need to have a good number six number two uh, I do think we need to get like a backup keeper because Adrian has left so that would be like option three or something we are going to send a defender. I had that central defender because mm-hmm. Matip has left, so there's no defender on the bench apart from Joe Gomez. So which means now we need Konate and Virgil now is getting old also, so we need yeah. like get players play. What's the situation with Virgil Van Dijk? Is he leaving? He's not leaving. He's still under contract, but now you see he still has to chat the manager and no and no like let's see if he's. G- I think he's gonna get an extension like one year or something. Him and Salah, him Salah, and then Trent. I think will get a new contract. I think because they are all their contracts are up next summer. Mm. So I how old is how old is Salah next year? Salah is 33. 34. Hey, you guys next, next season, bro. It, yeah. You guys are gonna have a season. Um, man. Again, I just I I predict it. I can just see. And Thiago, like a fifth. Thiago has yeah, left. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like Thiago's left. So you guys don't need to replace him. him. You see yeah. Sorry, guy. what's that guy? Um, uh, Mateta. Mateta. Because he's Crystal Palace at Anfield. That guy starts for your club. And it's yeah, he does. And it's lot. Under pressure. I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to So, Thiago left, which means we need to replace him, need to, replace him to replace someone on the bench. So you the guys have a lot of now work. Now, the forwards now, that's where now the issue is because I do think we're going to send a striker. Another one. Another now, the one. The best finisher in Liverpool's ever history. Who is that? Jota. Jota. And then you also have... And then you also have... Uh, Darwin Nunes. We have a problem now of deciding <laughs> where Gakpo plays. You know what? Let's actually. I'm going to ask you a question. Eh? Mm. <laughs> What's a better striking pairing? <laughs> yeah. Jota and Darwin Nunes, mm. or Zerkzi and Hoyland? Yes, a tough one. Yes, tough one. Can't even tell. It's not though. tough for us. It's not tough for me. It's 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 neck and neck. <laughs> no, it's not. It's neck and neck. <laughs> it's neck and neck. <laughs> Listen. It's a mid off. <laughs> I'm not even going to pick Nunes. I'm going to pick like a guy who doesn't play all the games for us. Let's pick Avi Elliott. And he's no, not I'm even a striker. striker. He's not even a striker. No, I want to put his numbers against Hoyland's numbers. Huh. For you to see, their man is a joke. My players are actually like delivering numbers. You're not winning the league, but they're you delivering. can't compare me. You cannot compare my numbers. I'm mm. saying they're not delivering mm-hmm. the league, but you cannot compare my numbers to this man. Your players have become delivery men, eh? Mm? So the yeah, they, what so are your players so delivering? Global, so. mm? global, global looking as. So we just have need to sort uh, where. <laughs> so we just need to get a striker, uh, three midfielders, and four defenders. We're not getting three midfielders. We're only getting one midfielder, one centre back. <laughs> Two midfielders: Thiago Alcantara and a and the central defensive. Midfielder. You know, we still need to. We still have Rian Graven back. Who couldn't He's even? He's not a defensive midfielder. Bro, couldn't get a sniff of Euros, bro. 
<laughs> he didn't play even a minute. <laughs> Did you see him? <laughs> no, he didn't. Yeah, I think he came off the bench. I yeah? think even Holland have, have a, a, Holland have a quota for black players. Yeah, yeah. same thing. Come same like France. Some, come like France. Yeah, makes sense. Yeah. Occupy, Why are you always occupying the wrong racist jokes? What do you occupy? <laughs> occupy Naim's house. <laughs> Dutch people. Yo, um, <laughs> <laughs> yo um, okay, and then defense midfield and two centre backs. You don't have to sign two though, because we have three centre backs right now, and they still that kid from you the, from the four, academy. Bro. It's called who? Uh, there's a kid that played for us. Uh, Kwanza. Jared Kwanza. I think he's for the future. Yeah, Kwanza is really And good. we have a midfielder on the bench who's coming from the injury. Budgety. The future from the future the future of Spanish Budget football. Budgety, yeah, true. Budgety. Come on, you can fit and you can Euros. Budgety is Spanish. Oh, yeah, he's Spanish. He's Spanish. He's Stefan, yeah. He doesn't sound Spanish. He actually he was actually before he got injured, he was caught for one of the international games. Yeah, I know. We spoke about it. You know it. we're gonna we sign we're training. gonna sign Budget Itch. Mm. G for 500k from Liverpool from Celta Vigo. Oh, I play for Celta Vigo. Yeah, but then we messed up the transfer because we asked his dad to uh, unregister him from Celta Vigo. Yeah. But his dad worked for Celta Vigo, so it's like oh, conflict yeah. of interest. And then he oh. said, "Nah, you guys are trifling." Shit. Man, Yo, United are, are fucking useless in transfers. Yo, That's why I'm so excited about this one. This mm. transfer. He's a good season. kid though. Like in Kuna Square Madrid, up to Le Pele, like midfield like Chesa. That was when he was younger. That was like yeah. last last season. I actually read budget. Last season could have been really good for him for development, especially when those kids were playing. And also, and you don't know how well he's gonna come back. He's coming back from a knee injury. Yeah, that's the issue now. So ACL or M- MCL, I think one of those. If we can get like let's say a player who's not like injury prone to play six, and then he can exchange with Wajaru and one, then we allow McAllister now to play like his position now. Really? I think would be in a good position, and then McAllister can help each other with. And then also you need and th- there's so many and thens that need. We to still have the scouts pillow though. And he hasn't even mentioned 60 million Shoboslai like yet. Eh? It, ah, we have the Shoboslai <laughs> guy. Slow boy, slow job. Mm. Blow job. <laughs> but I'm excited to <laughs> watch. I'm really excited to watch the Scouts <laughs> pillow this season. Who's that? Curtis Jones. Yeah. You Curtis can't be serious, Jones. Bro. He's been there for four years. And I, thought you're I thought you got. Uh, that guy is like under 21. Come on, man. You're talking like he's 29 or 28. He's under he's 21. 21. He plays for under 21. He might have like 23, though. Are you mad? Is that <laughs> is that is that the, you know they're allowed <laughs> one over it? When do no fanya kwa dogo? Ati Javier is still seventeen. Shut up, bro. We even got called out. I was fact checked. <laughs> you fact checked, man. Fact checked, man. Bro, this homie should be playing for the first team. Oh, he used to play for the under twenty. I told you, is that, is that exceptional? <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's twenty three. For under twenty one, they're allowed one old so player. So bro. he's still he's still he's still a young player though for that age. What? For that age, he's young. <laughs> He's what 23, playing for under 21s, but he's still young. <laughs> what did I say? He said he's still a player. He's still a young player for that age. <laughs> this guy is getting the Jesse well, Lingard <laughs> treatment, bro. Yeah, he is. Well, he is. he's getting the Jesse because Lingard he's, treatment because he looks bro. young. But him now to gonna have the LHP at the bench, and then we've got these kids who played for us last season. We're good, come on. I'm uh, curious about how. You think Javier that's gonna be enough for a title challenge? Q- Javier, I see, I see a future for. I think. But the uh, uh, Curtis Jones, first team, first team, <laughs> first team players like fa- like certain players need like two like defender and number six, and then the rest okay. now are the players like two <clears throat> to reinforce your scores like for Champions League, the FA Cup and stuff. Yo guys, just before we continue, um, I think my bottle has done a fantastic job. Hands up if it should replace Saddam permanently. Just. Put a like in the comments, man. Good job, Boro. I'm happy for you guys. You guys have your own Dutch Gabriel Jesus. Um, <laughs> but then when are you going to give up on that guy? Bro, we're going to give him one more season. Because uh, Kayavata's you, come. Have you, ever give, have you ever given up waiting for Jesus yourself? As a Christian. <laughs> Kai. Exactly. Of course. <laughs> because Kayavata's come and then replaced him now. It doesn't even look like we're going to sign a striker. It looks like now we're just going to try and sign a winger who can also... Produce goals and assists. What do you mean, winger? Right winger, like a for Saka's backup. Someone to push Saka. Some not just backup to push Saka. Yo, you remember last summer, Arsenal fans used to say we need to sign Mohamed Kudus to be Saka's backup. <laughs> That's how disre- disrespectful these guys are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, co- it's it's true. You have to come and earn your place. Yeah, Mohamed Kudus. What did he do? What did he do? He had like four goals. That's not true. And one on. overhead kick against Man City, which didn't even help us. What about Saka? Fucking lied to us, man. He said he was gonna do Thomas Partey a favor, my brother. Shut up, man. My oh, bro- but they Partey, so you're gonna replace it now, man. Huh? What happens to Partey? Partey. Par- I, I think we're gonna sell him Saudi. Elena is gone. And then he's gone. He's we the captain s- for the Olympics team. Sell, we can sell Partey to Saudi. I think that's what's gonna happen. Hmm. But we just haven't gotten any offers. 
But at the same time, now, actually, we might sign a guy called Merino from Spain, the Spain fielder. Yeah. He's in the national team. Well, it's Atecha's eye, you know? Kiwior is also, you guys are listening to offers for Kiwior. And Zinchenko. Calafiori, I don't know. Calafiori is coming. It's close. I think yeah. Zinchenko, in my opinion, is a weaker link between him and Kiwior, like, if you compare the two. Yeah, I'd rather Kiwior play than Zinchenko. I, I, get, I get the heebie jeebies. But now Calafiori, like that, that back line, like it's gonna have aura, man. So much aura, bro. <laughs> Saliba, Ben White, Gabriel, Raya, and Calafiori. Raya has Jeez. no aura, man. What? So Raya might, has hella aura. Yo, nah, bro. So you guys don't have to win the league. Knows job uh, is. You have to win the league. We have to win the league. You can't have aura, bro. We have our own Maldini region. <laughs> bro, have you seen Nesta used to wear a headband? <laughs> Cannavaro used to wear a headband. Yeah. Maldini used to wear a headband. Yeah, Javinho used to wear a headband. Shut the fuck up! Why not mention him, your man? He actually paid for you. Yeah, but Javinho's not Italian. <laughs> also, he had none of... His hair, we can't say that was his hair. We don't know for sure. It was bald. We don't know that that was his hair for sure. So, the rest of these men, at least that's their hair for sure. Um, I think we need to sign a player mm. to help Declan Rice be the new Jacques. So Jacques, Jacques' role, the eighth role, Declan Rice takes on that role more, pr- more, more dominantly, mm. or more oftenly, and then get a proper some, six. Get a proper six now. Mm. You yeah, get someone to now be the younger Jorginho for our team, or oh, be yeah, the yeah. younger party. Yeah, I think that's what we need. I see that vision. Yeah, and then and then Kai Havertz. I don't know, man. Like he's 24, bro. He scored 13 Premier League goals last season. That was his first season under Arteta, trying to figure it all out. You know, zero zero seven. Bro, remember, you guys really try and push that agenda. <laughs> we didn't try. It came to us. Tried, it came to us. The agenda found us. He <laughs> didn't score in the first seven games. Nah, you guys got loaned that agenda from Jaden Sancho. <laughs> no, but, <laughs> but he, he, he was the 007. No, he, he was wasn't. The, he was the second coming of the 07. Yeah, he, he wasn't. He was. He was. He was. No, he scored the pen. No, nah, he didn't score the pen. The pen came after. The pen came, came after. after. Right. Mason Mount was the third coming. Mason Mount is not a striker. He doesn't apply. <laughs> no, it was like a average. He started Mount as a, a injured, central midfielder. He scores just some goal. There's, injured, a, there's something that he got some, and he got injured too. Yeah. yeah. So he yeah. lost the count. <laughs> lost the count. That sounds like Ruto. <laughs> Blood fucking man. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so I guess is there is there any other transfer that we talk about? No. Um, there's no real big transfer. There's a yet. kid from France. They are trying to. Well, say Dior. See, he rejected, and he's going to. He's been rejected by a 19 year old. No, I don't think he's rejected. Where's the Riz? He hasn't given his... There's no other Riz. He hasn't given The only Riz they have is for other Dutch people. White versus mm-hmm. white. He it's because the Nag speaks to them in Dutch. Exactly. He hasn't given his uh, decision yet. Why is he not accepted or but rejected? But I also think that it could be a negotiation ploy by Manchester United. But if you, you guys don't have like... you To show Everton that if Len Euro has bid has been accepted for... What is it? 45? Mm. That maybe... This Branthwit kid you guys are trying to sell us at 70 is actually Pro not a 70 million. There are two babes here. Okay. One Defender. is a 10, proper 10, complete. You know what I mean? And then another one is a 10. It used to be 10 now, but now she's like a 6. Who's that? That's you, United. Yeah, Yeah, but you see, because of nice. the power of makeup and, you know, you know what I'm talking about, ladies. Investing in the future. You can always, <laughs> nah, bro. you know, fake it till you make it. But if he goes to Madrid, he's going to have to play... Back up to Militao. In Madrid right now, and he can uh, bench Militao, bro. No, he can't. And uh, and right what? now, Militao is injury prone. And right now, Madrid. If he comes to your place, he plays, but his career gets ruined. I feel like Madrid right now, right, are in a state of flux in terms of finances because of the Mbappe deal. He's on a free. Yeah, but they're still add-ons. Add-ons. Then they can afford anything. And his contract is quite massive, and wages. They've relieved of Nani. Tony Cruz's salary. No, I'm just saying, bro. Your yeah. salary is gone. I'm, of just, I'm just saying, bro. The bro, just because, lose gone, yeah. Mbappe just because you're broke, don't no, think no, everyone is broke. Big chunk of that Mbappe wage. thing. We're not broke. It's just PSR, bruv. Get it right. This is not Liverpool, yeah? So, there's no yo, Liverpool. L- let us know if there's any <laughs> other interesting. I took Omar's inside. You see, the last one called Saba. I want to call a new game with three. Yo, you saw the picture of Pickford uh, behind. Yeah. Van Dyke. Yeah. That's unprofessional, yeah. no? Yeah. yeah. Everything won. If it's um, in the brain, we catch feelings. So, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Uh, massive thanks to GoTV for sponsoring uh, the videos during the course of the Euros campaign. Remember, that was 999 for a whole month for all the 54 games, and you can still use that to watch 
for the final as well. And we'll see you guys again at some point very soon. Next as we week. get into next week after the final, we'll be here. After the final, now we're going to the onslaught era. Welcome. So yeah, see you guys next week for the onslaught era. Nasty work that is. Oh,